Okay, hey guys, this guy's Montana here, the original demo disc player, before they decided to give it an abbreviation, what it was just called. What it was called. We're back again with a new Kale Perico guide, and this one is the main docks. We are coming in on the long fin to the main docks because during the scoping mission, we found some good loot, right? And we want to grab that secondary loot before we go on to the main compound and get the primary target. Main docks loot locations accessible solo. Okay, so we're going to park the boat here. If you're not planning on getting back on the boat, because there's many a reason why you wouldn't, you can always park it on the land. But we're just going to leave it there just in case. Just to show you that you could leave it there where it's still in the water. Now, the first guy that we're going to take out is going to be right here, okay? And we are showing you this with the current state of affairs with the all the bugs and glitches that's been going on with this heist at this moment in time. I'm going to show you how to do this main docks without the alarm going off. We are pretty confident that we have found the formula, okay? Because there has been a lot of joke jokeries going on now you see this car this car going by you want to let that car go by okay we're going to kill him when he comes back because yeah we'll explain a little bit more on that in a second we're just going to take this camera out now this camera is by the first solo accessible secondary loot location you will come across on the main docks coming in on the long fin. Now, behind this loot hut, we're going to take out this guy. And here is a map of five different spawning locations for guard uniforms at the main docks. Because we actually found one during the scoping mission, we took a photograph of it. This is what you should be doing, is looking and preparing for the final, for things like that. Okay, the second guard uniform will be right there, right next to that guard, just to the left of him. So you've got one there, and you've got one there. We're going to leave the guard uniform just in case you don't get a guard uniform. We're going to make this a little bit harder for ourselves just so you can see how it's done with and without. Now, take out this guy. Don't worry about the car seeing the bodies, okay? Now, that car does see bodies, okay? We've made videos on the North Docks and the Airstrip, okay? And we were stressing that the cars do not see the bodies, but uh, this car wants to see bodies. Now... We're going to kill him when he comes back and he's about there. And he's coming right now. So, we're going to be comfortably here. And then boom. Now, the third guard uniform that you can get at the main docks is right here. There's five spawning locations for guard uniforms. Here is the third, okay? And here is your second solo accessible secondary loot, okay? Now, there is a two-player minimum loot over there. We're not going to cover that, okay? This is a solo guide, okay? But it's right there, okay? If you needed it, I'm sure you'll be fine. Now, um, there is a container right there. I know it's a bit dark. We always play this at nighttime. I do apologize. We always play this at nighttime. We could play it in the daytime, but we always play it at nighttime. There is the fourth guard uniform inside this container right here, okay? Now, um, if if you just needed loot from there and say there, so the best loot that you could possibly get is, is in these two huts, you're good, okay? You're good. That's basically what you want because the next part is the most buggiest part of the main docks, okay? Now, we're going to take out this guy in the guard tower. And he's right there, okay? And we're going to take out the camera as well, just to be sure. Which is right underneath. 
Um, make sure you take out the guy in the guard tower before you take out the, car, uh, the camera, okay? If you take out the camera first, the guy in the guard tower will hear you. Now, you see this guy across the river here? He might not be there. He spawns in like three different places. Um, he's there now, so we're going to kill him right now. there okay but he might be standing over there next to that boat or he might be well, let's just cross the river and we'll show you now this is the area where it is the worst in terms of bugs now this guy in the guard tower needs to go because this guy's a big problem um we have run into many a problem with this guy doing our tests okay um we're gonna take him out now he's moving Okay, he's down. Um, now, you see this little hut here, this little white hut? The guy that we just killed walking up and down, that's where he might spawn as well. Okay? The guy that's dead over there. Um, here is the fourth guard uniform. Sorry, the fifth guard uniform. Okay? We got the two guard uniforms behind secondary loot spawning location for a solo player. One. Hut number one. And um, three and four guard uniforms are on the left and right of secondary loot hut number two. And then here's number five, okay? Now there is a sixth one, and it spawns right next to this hut here. But we don't go anywhere near there, okay? That is just you're asking for trouble. Now, as you see, we killed this guy. We always kill him when he's there, okay? We always kill him there. Now... Here is your first out of two double kills outside the main compound here at the main docks that you will have to do, okay? If you're after these loots, that is. You may not have to if you've already got your loot because it was at the first part of the main docks, but uh, we're just going to wait for these cars to go by and then we're going to show you how to deal with this double kill like it's nothing. Now, the guy behind the double kill as you can see on the radar, needs to go first, okay? And we're actually going to wait for him to, because he's about to turn around now anyway, and make this difficult for us. We're just going to show you something. When we came in, there's a long fin. We found the truck to go through the main gate of the main compound, okay? We took a photograph of it, and there it is, okay? The second spawning location for the truck at the main docks is right next to us, right here. Possible truck spawns from the main docks. So if it's, in, if it's not in those two locations, that means it's spawned either outside the main compound or at the north docks or at the airstrip. Okay, we're going to take this guy out now. We can actually take him out from here. 
which is perfect. Okay, we're taking a bit longer about this. <laughs> um, okay, so if he wasn't there, I wouldn't recommend walking forward here, because see this crack right here? They'll see you through the crack. Okay. They'll see you straight through that. We can let this car go by him. I'm going to show you what we would have done. Okay. I really can't see you through that wall. Yeah, we would have just gone around here and shot him there. Or we would have shot him when he was in there, okay? As long as he had his, his back to us. Don't worry about that camera. As long as you're, you're staying out of the way of it, you're fine. You could always take that camera out, though. But the reason we're not taking that camera out, we'll tell you in a second. But, um... Let's just show you how to do this double kill. The best way to do a double kill... This is on auto aim, okay, by the way. This shotgun... You aim at one... Pop him in the head. And then you let go... Of L2... And then as soon as you hold L2... There's only one guy to aim at, and it's the other guy. Then just pop him three, two to three times in the chest, just like this. See? In fact, he died on one shot the second guy. Uh, um, but I would say two to three, just in case. Um, yeah, with the camera, I was going to say, um, that guy, if he spawns there, make sure you take out the camera and then take him out. Um, be quick about it. But, like I say, just leave the camera and leave the guy, and you're fine, whether he spawns there or not, okay? Now, we have tested this a lot of times, okay? We want to make sure people can get their secondary loot, no matter where it is, okay? No matter where it spawns at the, at the main docks. Now, we're going to move on up here now that car's gone. If the car was, like, going around this bend here, what you want to do is just hide here, Okay? Wait for it to go by. And then climb over and grab this truck. And move along. Okay, remember there's two cars that actually could go along here. Once you see the two cars. One of the cars will keep coming back. And the other car will take forever to come back. But he will come back. Okay. He takes a long time. And I think he's actually coming back now. But anyway, let's just move on to the last secondary loop. Spawning location. Okay, so, when we get to here, take this guy out, if you want to. He takes a long time to come back, but he will come back. So you would have enough time to actually grab the loot and get the hell out of here. But yeah, this is your second double kill. Boom. Boom. Okay, and then here is the, the last secondary loot uh, spawning location. Okay, let's just say that you had the guard uniform on a truck, right, and it spawned here. What you would do is everything that we just did, which, which was take out all of those guards, including the guy in the guard tower and everything. So let's just say you grabbed, you grabbed that, yeah? And you still had half the bag to fill and you knew because during the scoping mission you found another one of those at one of the other loot locations. You just drive the truck around here And then what you would do here is basically the same stuff. You can leave the truck there, or you can drive it a little bit more forward, in fact. You see, this guard is here, and this guard is here. Let's just say, secondary release in there, you know what to do. We've already shown you what to do with that. So now we'll just go and get the truck. And then you grab the secondary loop from there. And then you just make your way to the main compound after that. Okay? Just make your way to the main compound and go through the gate. Let's just say you didn't have the truck. Okay? You didn't have the truck to go through the main gate. Then what you would do is just take any vehicle you could find. You could just drive through the main gate. Like this. Go past the yellow marker. Round to the side here. And then you could drop down into the water and then go through the drainage tunnel, okay? Yeah. If you didn't have a guard uniform and you needed to grab all this loot, what you would do is 
get the uh, long, go back to your long fin or grab a dinghy from from here or something. Anywhere along here, there's dinghies, okay? So there's dinghies there and there's dinghies there. And here we are at the drainage tunnel, okay? So we would have a full secondary loot bag and then we will go and deal with the main compound, okay? So guys, that is the end of the main docks secondary loot scenario. Good loot scenario, okay? We are going to do a full video on the main compound. Different ways of doing the main compound when you're actually inside it. So um, make sure you check that video out and um, subscribe if you're not subscribed. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss any more GTA videos just like this one. And uh, share, the, share the video and uh, comment down below. Have a nice day, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Uh, peace out.